It's the bald and the beautiful. They know all about you. Everything from Nashville to Hollywood on My Country 96.1. Candy, let's start with Luke Combs. His cover of Tracy Chapman's Fast Car has set a bunch of records. Check this out. Uh, it is not only his 16th consecutive number one hit to start his career, but it's the first cover of a pop song uh, to hit number one in country music since 2008 when Blake Shelton covered Michael Bublé's Home. Oh, I love yeah. that. Mm-hmm. And another record setter, Tracy Chapman now becomes the first black woman to solo write on a, you know, get songwriting credit by herself solo on a number one country song in history. Wow! It, oh, how yeah. things go round. Yeah, it's a uh, it's a big deal, and yeah, uh, Luke was asked if Tracy had reached out to him, and he said no, and he said that's okay because he says, "Do you know how many people have covered Fast Car? I'm not the first, so no, he's not. It's a great song, and yeah, it's been covered before. Yeah, um, Dublin Deck tonight. Yeah, big country night. We're back. It feels like a Monday, but it's a Wednesday tonight. Candy. I know my head is spitting. I don't know what's happening. We will be there with Whiskey Road tonight, Dublin Deck, 7 o'clock. We start 6 o'clock. The band is on uh, under gorgeous skies. Joey Chestnut wins his 16th Nathan's Hot Dog Eating Contest yesterday. It took a little time to get there, though. They had, like, lightning, and, oh, what a mess. Yeah, there was a weather delay. Uh, He also didn't even come close to his old record. He's slowing down in his old age, kid. Oh, please. I cannot watch it. It makes me gag. They got it in. They say it it has never been canceled. They weren't canceling it yesterday. Yeah. Uh, He only ate 62 hot dogs. Is that all just 62? Yeah. Uh, Taylor Swift, on her way to a tour that'll gross uh, well over a billion dollars, and that'll easily break the record. Elton John and his farewell tour uh, currently holds the record with $887 million. Oh, Taylor catching up. Yep. Uh, Kevin Costner giving his estranged wife till July 13th to leave the house. Now, don't ask me. Don't ask me what happens after July 13th, but that's... <laughs> That's the date. The last I read, she was leaving August 1st. Now they're going to argue over 10 days, three, you know, yeah. maybe three weeks. Okay. Yeah. Uh, Greta Gerwig, the director of Barbie, is going to direct two Narnia films for Netflix now. Oh, love Narnia. Yep. Uh, there's a Harry Potter reboot for Max, uh, but Daniel Radcliffe says... Uh, he has no need uh, to be in it or pa- uh, pass the torch. He says, the torch can pass without me being in the film. Uh, it'll be fine. He's definitely devoted a lot of time to Harry Potter. Yeah. Uh, and he doesn't want to ruin his legacy either with that. So. No. No. And finally, you know, Mark Harmon has written a book about how real NCIS formed, like the real organization, NCIS. Formed. Oh, yeah, mm-hmm. so I thought that's... He's very into it, obviously. It's obviously, name. yeah, I love it. Yeah. Uh, TV tonight, I'll give you the one big thing here on Hulu. Uh, it's a CMA Fest special on 50 years of CMA Fest, which just took place, the 50th anniversary, uh, back in Nashville a couple of weeks ago. So uh, that's on Hulu, starts today. And there you have it, your bald and the beautiful entertainment, everything from Nashville to Hollywood, looking at a hot, gorgeous day. Going to be sunshine today, up to about 85. By the time we get to Dublin Deck tonight, it'll be down to about 77, 78 there in Patchog. And uh, we're in for a great night. Enjoy it. Let's hit the roads. My country, 96.1. Fathead and Candy in the morning, weekdays, 6 to 10 a.m. on My Country, 96.1.